Are you a little shabby? Or perhaps a little chic? Well, if you can't decide, sit tight. We'll be taking care of both. sometimes too, and something very fun and easy you can do at home is give things a shabby chic look. And we're going to take this desk today and paint it to just age it and make it a little more rustic. So to start with, what you'll need is some paint, a base coat, a highlight coat, or an accent coat of paint. It can be gray or it can be brown. I'm using black. You also need some wood wax, some sandpaper, and some rags to get started. So, with that being said, let's go. Let's start by putting our base coat on our desk. And I'm going to go ahead and do two coats on this piece. Now that our table has dried, go ahead and use sandpaper in places that might normally wear on your piece, uh, such as the edges and the corners. That way, it'll give it more of an authentic, <laughs> an off, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. All right, let's take our wood wax and apply it to our entire piece. Remember, a dab will do it. And this is looking beautiful. Go ahead and continue to apply it to the entire piece. I love it. This turned out really well, guys. Um, buffed out the wax, have it ready to go, and for this next part, we put our wood wax on that's clear to make our accent color wax. What we're going to do is take some of the regular wax and melt it in a jar in boiling water. Then add just a little bit of the accent color you want. I'm going to use black. Also, I might try blue and gray because they work really well. And then once it hardens, we can apply it to the piece. So here you can see I have my clear wax in the jar on the stove and I heated it just enough so I can pour it into my black paint and be very, very careful here. Uh, whatever accent color you use, only use a little bit because too much paint will ruin your wax. And now let this cool down for a minute or two and then stir the wax and the paint together and leave it to harden. Okay, now that we have our accent wax hardened, we can use it in just a little bit of places to create a little more depth and dimension. Mind you, less is more, so take it easy. Let's apply it right here. Let me show you. Take a little bit of wax on your rag, not too much, just slight. And for this part, I'm going to try to get a little burnt look. So I'm just going to slowly apply it and rub it in. I'm also going to apply a little bit of wax right here to the leg. And there we go, just a little bit here and there. I don't want to take too much away from this white, so I don't want to go too crazy. And there you have it, something fun and easy you can do at home that can bring new life in an old way. But remember, whether you build things or bake things, people need you. So go out and do good. 